Passepartout, what are they and what are they for? That's the questions that we'll try to answer in this short video. Now this isn't going to be a tutorial but I will show you the tools, the materials and the process that I use to create a Passepartout. Well, the Passepartout, very simply put, is a sheet of cardboard. It's got a hole cut in it and it's used to display artwork. This method of window mounting art has two main functions. First of all, protection. The Passepartout not only keeps the artwork rigid and stops it from bending, uh, but it also, very importantly, creates thin gap right across the face of the image. Now this is critical anytime that you're going to want to frame your artwork or display it behind glass. Secondly, it creates a border around the image itself. This isolates it from any external visual noise or distractions. It allows the artwork to breathe. This has the effect of drawing the viewer's eye right into the center, increasing the impact. So those are the two main functions of the Passport Tour. Number one, to protect, and number two, to increase impact. You can make a Passport Tour using only the simplest tools. Pencil, a ruler, and a knife. I like to use one additional tool, which allows me to make precise cuts of 45 degrees. This gives you the beautiful beveled edge around the outside of the window. It's very hard to do when cutting freehand. I like a bright white 1.6 millimeter slightly textured mat board for its clean minimalistic finish. Having cut the outer dimensions of the board to size, I use a template to draw the outline of the window on the back of the mat board. Ensuring I have a fresh blade in the 45 degree angle cutter, I then make the four cuts around the edges of the window. Always ensuring that the cuts meet at the corners but don't overshoot. It's tricky at first and it requires a lot of practice, but ultimately you can achieve a level of precision down to a fraction of a millimeter. So now you've got your passport tool window ready to display your artwork. This photo I took back in 2013 in a little village in the center of France. For a personal touch I also like to stamp my logo and add my signature down here in the corner. So there you have it. A passport tool is a window mount which brings your artwork to life and protects it at the same time. I love the high level of professional finish that a classic Passepartout gives to a piece of fine art photography. For me, they're an integral part of the finished piece. And that's why I use them to present all my prints. I hope this video was informative and I'll link here to a couple of other videos if you're curious to know more about how I make and sell travel photography prints. Passe partout. Pourquoi les Américains disent passe partout? Boris, pourquoi passe partout? Je ne sais pas pourquoi. C'est mon français très étrange.